Big day today, guys. Big day. Linz and I are both getting an iPhone 10. We're on our way to go pick them up now. And then we're going to do a review, unboxing deal of the iPhone 10. Filmed with the iPhone 10. Lindsay's idea. Let's uh, let's go get Lindsay's first, and then we'll go get mine. Up a tree. Probably 40 people. Oh no. Yeah. And so it's probably faster to go get my iPhone oh, and then come no. back. Because I've got a half hour window to pick mine up. Oh, shice. And those people will probably be done by the time we get back. So oh. let's do that. My phone's being held at the Apple store. Lindsay's is being held at UPS. I've got a half hour window to pick mine up. So we're going to get my swing it back. I'm going to go shopping for a minute. Yeah. yeah. At 9 a.m. while the crowds aren't here. Holy cow. Look, there they are. Sitting there on the shelf. <laughs> yeah. There it is, Lens. I got mine. He's now we gotta go get yours. Let's try number two. Boys and girls, he's got it. Babe, what's in the box? An iPhone. Okay, so this is Lindsay's iPhone. We've got my iPhone. We're gonna go home. The rest of this video is going to be filmed on my iPhone of Lindsay unboxing her iPhone. So I've got my phone uh, unboxed to the point that uh, the camera works and then Lindsay hasn't really messed with it or seen much of it at all. So we're gonna go home and unbox Lindsay's phone right now. And everything from here on out is filmed on the iPhone 10's camera. <laughs> Did you get that? Yep. Don't put that on there, guys. Up a tree. Lynn's. I'm waiting a long time for this. Lynn's surprisingly like she doesn't get that excited about this kind of stuff like I do, but this time she was freaking stoked. If I ever show any excitement over any tech thing, this kid gets so pumped. Now, look at it. Oh. Man. Look at all the all the way from China. An iPhone 10 review filmed on an iPhone 10. There it is. iPhone. Ooh. Is your? Oh, okay. Never mind. It's mine. Oh, you don't have to cut it, girl. I know, I wasn't gonna. Yep. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. You wanna know something funny I just noticed? What? This, <laughs> this phone costs more than my wedding ring. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine with that. All right, ready? Wait, 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 wait. Bay Apple, California. We don't need to take that stuff out. Everyone already sees that. It's mostly, oh. we just need to see your reaction. Oh my gosh, Lens. Oh, look at that white, that is pretty. That white. Okay, ready? That's nice. <laughs> oh, look at how good it looks. Look at how good it looks. Oh, it's so nice. It is so sick. That feels so good. What does this feel like? This feels like, it, if this was gold, it'd feel like a gold brick, is what this would feel like. <laughs> this is awesome. Okay, I'm gonna turn it on now. So. Take us on a walk through the phone lens. So I don't really know what any of these buttons are anymore, even though they've slightly changed. They're By the way, the same. this is an extremely, sh Lindsay is not a tech person, so this is, don't judge anything. This is from says. a basic, Yes. <laughs> This is from a non-tech uh, person's review of the first impression. I turned it on. Time. Good job. So I guess you had that figured out. Mm -hmm. See, people are complaining a lot about the iPhone 10 because there's no buttons and it's not as intuitive okay, as it yeah, used to be. It's insane. It's just all... It's all screen. All just black and there's no buttons. While Lindsay's setting up her phone, I just wanted to show you guys real quick. We got uh, this new lamp. It's a wireless charging lamp from Ikea. And then yesterday... We uh, did this. These are our nightstands, and we integrated these wireless chargers in from Ikea as well. They're 12 bucks. Uh, you can buy a little drill bit that drills right in. This is also an Ikea dresser, but it just drills right into the top there, and then you slide the charger in, and then the cords go behind it and everything. So Really nice and easy to get your stuff charged. It's not very fast, but we figure it's on our desk, so it'll just be for an overnight charge. So. All right, let's do this Face ID thing. I feel like everybody's seen this like a thousand times. Oh, yikes. I don't know. Are you supposed to? You're supposed to look or no? Yeah. Okay. That's it? Mm-hmm. And then hit continue. It'll do it one more time. Well, I think 
I mean, obviously, I feel like this one's a lot heavier. Not a lot heavier. It just feels nice, like dense. Feels solid. This feels solid too, but this feels like, I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. I'm struggling. <laughs> Do you know what this reminds me of? Just because it has like the metal on the outside and then like the feel of it. it reminds me of like the older iPhones and iPod, like iPod touches and stuff like that. Yeah. And you know what I mean? Like The stainless steel definitely helps with that feeling. Yeah. Like I must feel like we're going back, but in a good way. That's how I feel about this phone. Okay, Lynn's any last first impressions before, I mean, your phone is setting up, but you've played with mine a little bit now while yours is going through the setup update. The thing is they come, out of the box, ready to go with the software update. So her software is updating, her phone's gonna be backing up and restoring from the old one. So she's got a while before she can really play with it. So she's been kind of messing with mine. So what do you think? What do you mean? Do you like it? I like it. Um, I'm excited to play with it more and see how frustrated I get when I try to hit home buttons. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else? Um, do you think people- This notch though, am I right? Oh, the notch. What about this notch? <laughs> It's, I almost don't even want this phone anymore. Look at this notch. Honestly, I've had okay. mine, I've been playing with mine for about an hour and a half now, and I've already kind of forgotten about it. Even about with, the notch? Yeah, yeah, texting, look at, look videos. At look at this screen, though. Look at this screen, though. It's so much bigger. Uh, the screen is bigger than the actual footprint of the old iPhone. Yeah. It's so, a good size. Love the screen. Pretty good stuff. Stoked. All right, let's get some good, uh, let's get some good cinematic B-roll shots of these phones and then that'll be the end of the vlog, huh? So those last shots, the slow motion ones were filmed with the A6500, gotta make it look good, you know? But we're done for now with the unboxing type deal. Uh, it's more of just Lindsay's first impressions with the iPhone 10 because she was extremely excited, which is unusual for her with tech products. So I uh, just thought it'd be fun to film. And uh, it's been a minor test of the iPhone 10's camera, but we'll probably make a more in-depth video when we've had more time with this. So if you like what you saw, give us a subscribe. Otherwise, uh, yeah, sorry that you didn't like it. Also, but. for all you iPhone fans, look how sad this is that I have to put a cover on my phone. <laughs> Lindsay drops her phones like mad. Oh, you don't want to trust me. And they and told us at the Apple store that it's $300 to fix the screen. It's $250 for the front, and if you break the back, they actually have to replace the entire phone. So they it's said- like $500. Yeah, they highly suggested Apple Care for what it's worth. Um, we didn't get Apple Care. The Therefore, phone's expensive enough. screen covers. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, over. peace.